Hey guys, this is Heldozer from Zombieland Gaming, and I'm back in Fade to Silence. Now, I did go ahead and went back and got the dogs. So, to show that, um, let's see what we got here. I have the doghouse built. Jin wound up getting both of the huts built. Now, as you can see, I have the teleport. So, I went ahead and just did this because I had already kind of done it uh, before and didn't really think I should just re-record me doing it all over again. But, the one thing I did discover was there were actually some mats up there I had missed the first time. And there's a little cave right up in here like a so that obviously will open up to another area. Now, it does appear that this is a pretty decent sized map. So, what my next plan of attack is going to be is um, I want to investigate over here. I want to get some of this stuff uh, unlocked so that uh, my guys can, my guy can run around doing whatever he's going to do. I also want to see if I can discover where this next guy is because it's not showing up on my map. So I kind of wanted to, I'm just going to set markers and go and do stuff and things to try to get... Uh, stuff figured out and see what I can find. Now it does look like there's going to be an attack tonight so I'm going to go ahead there's a green guy out there and there's this guy here so I'm going to go ahead and uh, whack out these guys real quick. And this is the result of getting the dogs. So the uh, sled actually just appears inside the back of the dog uh, house uh, kennel. So, that is there waiting on you for uh, when you do release the dogs, the two wolves. So I'm going to use this guy to travel around. I just wanted to whack that guy out real quick like... So, what am I carrying around? Okay, got food, got Healy stuff, got a fire. Can I, as you can see, there is a little storage box on there. So that's kind of cool. Now remember the handling of this thing was actually kind of cool. It was actually really smooth the last time I had actually had this. And it seems like they actually made it a little smoother. I don't know if there's more hounds that you can add to this little, uh, to this ride. But this is definitely going to make getting around a hell of a lot easier. Oh, excuse me, pardon me. All right. Okay, so... I'm going to hit you. No, I don't want to open it. I'm going to hit you to, to replace it. Now, that is kind of cool that you can do that. Um, before, it was a little buggy when you would go to do that. But now, it seems like they've kind of smoothened that out a little bit. Okay, and this definitely hasn't changed. This is the this is a corrupted area. So, you have to clear out the corruption first. Which kind of makes sense that they wouldn't want any part of this. So it looks like I picked everything up. Okay, so pressing the U button doesn't automatically call it. You actually have to go back to it. And I'm not sure. They're there.
Okay, so I'm going to take a look at the map right quickly. Okay, so... Like I said, I just want to discover this stuff a little bit. Get around here, see what might be over here. And you can't use your little spider sense while you're on the... On the cart. Oh, yeah, yeah you can actually. Because something kind of lit up back here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and kill something out here so that my guys, so I can claim this area. Alright, so we'll go ahead and do that. Now, I haven't been here before, obviously, so there are a lot of mats out here. I just have to remember how far away I'm actually going from my... Okay, so those are some pretty masterful shots there. Thank you very much. Okay, so we got some chows, so now this area is claimed. My guy should be able to come out here hunting. And as you can see, the cart does actually light up um, from using spider sense. So that's kind of cool, so you won't lose it. There was something else right over in here, but... Oh, there it is. That was two hits. One front, one back. I am sorry, buddy. If I can hit you. Okay, so... Spider sense up that cart. There it is. I do believe that there is going to be an event tonight. So, what I am going to do is... And I am surprised. You can carry a ton of crap in there. Okay, so I'm going to look at the map real quick, like... Um, what area is up in there? Okay, so I got kind of a choice to make. I'm actually going to go to that northern wood spot. See, I don't want to... Kind of going through a uh, space that I've already been in. But there is a there's a fireplace there. But I want to hit out some wood. Just in case I do get caught up because I am getting cold. And I don't know where that big goofy guy is. And it seems like they're drawn to the road. Like I'm not steering right now, but they're definitely drawn to where the road part is of things are. So if you're on a trail or on a road, it's definitely, the dogs definitely want to stay on that, that kind of route there. Alright, let me see where am I, okay. I'm just about there. Little death scene is always kind of cool. So, I want to see if I can hit some wood real quick. 
Unfortunately, it seems to be corrupted in these... Oh, there we go. We got one. Now, earlier when I was running around, uh, Jin actually cleared out a corrupted area. I'm not quite sure what that means, but he cleared it out. So I don't know if that physically clears out an area. The only thing that I can say is, is that there was a wood symbol here that's now gone. So I'm thinking he may have cleared that out. Uh, Tyre, go to rest. He's resting. Deposited some wood. All right, so may as well just go for broke and go out here, I guess. I've got enough wood that if I want to build a house, I'll build a house out uh, yonder way and uh, hang out for the night. But I am definitely going to have to do something. There's the spider sense. I know what's going to happen. Alright, so we'll take that. Alright, so I'm not going to mess with him. Don't need to. There's an unhappy customer. Alright, we are in a corrupted area, so I'm going to clean, cleanse this up. Okay, that was uncalled for. Okay, he seems kind of upset that I have a card out here, so... Like they are pissed about something. Uh, that guy down there, I bet. Alright, so what I'm going to do is, is, this is a nice little house. Turn on spider sensor real quick. Yep, I already see where this is going. So we're just going to go up to these houses over yonder way here. Alright, he's got some pristine wood. Have a lovely little backpack. Alright. So I know it takes... Yeah, I was out of stamina. Alright, so I got a little healing poultice on me. I'm going to leave the cart there. I'm not going to really venture out. I'm hungry, I'm cold. Yeah, now I now I have to heal. So we're gonna grab that stuff. Because now I do have to rest. I am definitely making a house.
All right, well, they are bent out of shape about something. Now, I built it. Where is it? Oh, my God, those dogs are driving me nuts. Okay. Okay, so what used to happen was this was, it wasn't like as fancy as a house. It was just like a little, like a pile of sticks that you would crawl in. Almost, almost kind of like, a, um, uh, what's the best way? Almost kind of like a, uh, like a body, uh, the hell am I, what the hell is the word I'm looking for here? Um, like a body sleeping bag made out of wood. I don't know if that makes sense, but it's almost kind of what it felt like uh, before. Okay, so where are you guys going? Um, so if it, they definitely kind of change it. It's definitely cool. I mean, there's no question about that. Alright, so rest is the buzz depositing wood. Okay, it seems like we've got another Okay, there's definitely a guy over there. Let me see, is there something here? Oh! Yeah. There certainly is the eclipse. I'm not sure what that means. It's clearly behind me, though, whatever is going on. So I will totally admit I have no idea what the eclipse is. No clue, no idea. But there seems to be something blinking here. What the hell was that?! Good God in heaven. I'm not... I don't give a shit what the eclipse is now. But you can go eat shit. I'm not going over there. We'll go see what the hell the eclipse is later. That's... Oh, that's horse shit. No, I don't... I'm not dying with a whole bunch of supplies on me. You can... Okay, so wherever the red dots are, I shouldn't be standing on them. Gotcha. Fair enough. Where in the hell am I going? Because I don't want any part of this. I thought, oh, you're supposed to stand on the red dots, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, how'd that work out for me? <laughs> Jerk. Oh God! Oh no! We got a we got a holy hell in a hand bath. Just drop a marker and get the hell out of here.
please get on. Alright, he's over th Oh, come on! Seriously? Alright, so he went, I don't know where he's going, but I may need to get the GTFO quickly here. Alright, so we grabbed that little guy. Okay, so I may veer off to the right here to hit off this metal. It looks like there's something over there. All right, the one thing that I have always learned is, is when you have a when you have a pocket full of loot, it is not the time to be Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa is not the time to be a hero. So, I have mining spots opened already. I just want to get my loot my loot home. There's a jerky jerk face over there. Okay, so that was an unexpected issue. Okay, so I'm not quite sure what just... I obviously hit a, this poop spot in the bridge, but my wolf is here. And the line is, as you can see on my screen... <sighs> so I'm hoping the game just redirected it back home? I don't know, but I had a lot of loot in there, and that's gonna piss me off. Yep, I bet a winter event. All right. All right, so everything's in there. Yep, uh, there's the sled.
Okay, so... Alright. So, let's check this... Stash? Yep, everything is there. Oh! Yeah, you can go eat a big pile of shit, pal. Alright, so I'm gonna turn this guy around. I think it's gonna there's gonna be a blizzard. Nice tight turn. So when you start it up, it's going to be right outside of your camp. Oh, no, no, no. Other way. Okay, now the one thing I am going to do is I'm going to go ahead and make some chow. Okay, you have to access it from this side. Okay, so the puppies are home. I can't really do anything. I guess that's going to be good enough. And like I said, winter event. Now, one of the cool things is that this fire now stays lit with a companion in your base. It wasn't like that before, so that's one kind of cool change that they've made. So as you can see, I've got a decent amount of wood. Good lord. Uh, we've got 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000. doesn't really matter how many thousands of stuff we've got there. One thing I am going to do is I'm going to cook up food because he is eating. That's very clear, and that's not from me... Yeah, he is eating. That is for sure. Yeah, I've only got six bowls of food. That's a lot of food for him to have... Uh... Now, the only thing I'm not sure is how to get more patterns or if there are more patterns. So I guess that that's going to be my next little adventure. Okay, so I'll sleep, I guess, for a little while. Okay, so I'm going to drop this food down in here like a so for Captain Fancy Pants. Um, I'm going to go ahead, grab my stuff back. I'm actually going to start carrying that with me. Um, okay, so he's got... Th there's 37 food in there. Um, it definitely seems like it's going to be the kind of thing where I'm going to have to go ahead and... Um, start, like, ad probably adding hunting in. Uh, riddled with blight. Hunting will salvage some of the meat and pelt. So I'm not going to cook that up. Uh, pristine remains. So I'm going to go ahead and eat for myself.
Okay, so as you can see, I've opened up more of the map. Um, which is cool. Um, I do have to get over in here. I can't go up and through, through here because it's actually blocked off. So I have to see what's going on over here. Now, I'm not sure what's going to do that if going and beating down that boss guy is going to be the thing or if I have to unlock all of this business, but... Um, I'm going to go out and get some meat for uh, my uh, little associate here. Matter of fact, before I do that, let's take a look and see what I can build. Okay, so... Very good to know. I need seven more salvage, a little less than halfway there for the medicine shack two more for the crafting shack so that's something to keep in mind a whole pile for the forge that's out of reach i already have a kennel that's not going to happen so it looks like it's definitely something uh i need a pile of salvage so exploring is definitely going to be on the menu for next time So I am going to go back out in that direction because I want to... There's a cabin out there, but I did see something. I did see some blight. And I'm not going to lie, my old butthole puckered up when I saw that big guy coming along and I got the hell out of there. Um, I kind of feel that the fear is kind of genuine and um, warranted because I did face what I did face that guy before in uh, a former game and I can tell you... That it is real. Um, oh, damn it, why? The, okay, like I was saying, the fear is real. That guy is definitely something to be afraid of. Um, he's definitely that, that big guy. I shot arrows into him and I, could, I was barely damaging him. So that tells me... I need to do something, I need to have something, something's going on that I don't have, more exploration, however you want to say. So, um, yeah, that, that guy's kind of terrifying. Okay, so it doesn't look like there's going to be any deers in here. So let's see where we are. Um... See, it says I was in a hunting area, but it looks like it's dried up. So, I either have to let it respawn, I guess? Which is no problem with me. I'll just go up to this one that I haven't discovered yet, whack out a couple of deer, and call it a day. Go ahead and set the marker. Alright, so I am heading in the right direction. Throwing the old spider sense again. Yep, some stuff slid up. Wouldn't you freaking know it? Alright, well actually I need one more piece of salvage to actually make something. So maybe I can find that piece of salvage out loafing a boot. As long as Big Papa Pump over there stays the hell away from me. You know, I just don't want to tempt it. I just don't want to push it. Alright, we got a deer. Two solid hits. Let's 
Three solid hits. Well, that was pretty good hunting right there. Um, not sure what just happened. Um, do we have a bug? I literally cannot move. I am frozen in place, and I don't know why. Um... Okay, I really don't want to, um, waste the life. Because that big guy is here, so I'm going to pause this and see if I can fix this. Okay, so nothing I have tried has worked, so I'm going to end the video here. Oh, God. Oh, this shit again. Okay, well, I'm going to end the video here, and hopefully uh, get business fixed. So I will see you guys again later. This has been Helldozer for Zombieland, and I really hope I don't die. See you guys.